The Chief of Defense Staff, General Liu Rabo, says the military and the media must pursue a common course of ensuring freedom and liberty for every citizen. He made the statement at an interactive session with media executives and editors in Abuja. This is the first time the Chief of Defense Staff will meet with media executives and editors. This meeting is meant to build sustainable trust between the military and the media. Both parties sometimes hold contrary views on what constitutes national security and what should or should not be reported. This mistrust is what the session is set to correct by being a consensus on what type of information can be released to the public in order to maintain healthy civil military relations. The theme of this session is the role of editors in national security and comprehensive communication. The Chief of Defense Staff, General Leo Erabo, is quick to clear the misimpression that the military is at loggerheads with the media. Rather, he believes the media has a critical role to play in the socio-economic development of the country. There is a common cause. That common cause is our freedom and liberty. That common cause is for a secure environment. The relationship has consistently been festy and frosty. It is highly expected that at the end of this party, a roadmap will be developed to chart a pact for clear rules or clear role for editors and media in national security matters and conflict sensitive communication. Participants acknowledge that social media, popularly called new media, has changed the face of reportage and fact checks are critical to avoid carrying fake news. In the wrong hands, social media can also be used as a weapon of coordinating violent social movement and terrorism in cyberspace, hence the need for regulations, legislation, public awareness and sanctions. Social media came and came with what? Affordability? Anonymity? These two, affordability and anonymity, that's why the bond of condition of terrorism is It's positive. Similarly, it's decentralized. It has global connectivity. Section 29 of the Constitution of the Federal Republic of Nigeria 1999 has amended, provide for freedom of expression and free press. Between public interest and national interest, these editors will tend with a code of ethics as Nigerians continue to look for information with evidence and concrete backing. Celestina Iria, TVC News, Abuja.